This is the day we've been waiting for. The grass has arrived. So we're just gonna get started with one truckload today. Make sure everybody's on board with how to build the bunkers. And then when it comes time to go full throttle, we'll be doing two or three, four truckloads a sod a day. But it's a great day in the neighborhood. First grass on the ground. start working on the green side bunkers after lunch so I've got the guys out we're just really checking some of these breaks in these greens and making sure that the contours are there there's a little ridge that kind of runs around this green right here and again we're using our little probe to figure out where it's a little too skinny and where it's a little too fat to make sure we get those nice contours this is the final process before we get ready to sod around the greens because once you put the grass around the greens you don't want to come back out of here until you're ready to sprig them so we're good there not bad there plus or minus a little bit is okay plus or minus a lot is a big problem Hey Country Club, it is Friday afternoon, about 4.30, heading home and give you a quick update. We have grass on the ground. We've got our first loads of sod in today, as you saw in the video, and that's a great thing. Um, so we have begun sodding bunker faces, slopes, things like that, lake banks on hole seven. Next Tuesday, we are going to get another truckload of sod and we'll start eight. And we're just purposefully easing into this whole sodding phase because the bunker building process is pretty exact with the drainage complex and everything inside the bunkers. Um, we just want to make sure we don't get the cart before the horse too much. It's easy to get six loads of sod, six truckloads of sod, but it's difficult to get ready for six truckloads of sod. So we're still perfectly fine on our grassing schedule um we actually are a little bit ahead on our grassing schedule so we want to make sure we're going to do things right you know i was talking to a friend of mine and he said he used to work for a company he said you know we're the best in the business because we got time to do things twice well i don't want to do that i just want to do it once and do it right and make sure we're all good to go so grass is going down and it's going very well irrigation is doing fine we are on schedule with that as well the front line or front nine main line is in all the way around holes one through nine and the driving range and the short game they all have their main line so we are good to go we are tied in on the south side loop that goes under Bernie Tree Drive and we are waiting on the right-of-way permit on the front nine or I should say on the north side, we're waiting on the the bore permit to go under Burning Tree Drive behind nine still. But it's just taking forever with the counting as it seems everything does. Um, so we're doing good there. They're flushing holes seven, eight, and nine are done with the irrigation. Nine has got just a little bit behind the green because of the whole under the road thing. We've got to tie all that in but it's done. Irrigation is running. We're all good to go. Um, irrigation on one is in. Irrigation on two is in. You got to flush those, adjust those heads, get them all loaded into the computer and all that kind of stuff. And they are beginning irrigation install, putting heads in on hole number three. So four and five were flagged. 
so they are ready for heads when the piping company the irrigation company is done with three they can just keep trucking I would think next week we probably are going to start digging main line on the back which I'm guessing is going to be going down like probably hold 10 11 12 we're going to start on the north end and work our way south so all that's going well um, it's exciting we're getting a little bit of rain thank gosh because I was tired of going home with dirt in my ears and you know I have to take a shower with my clothes on because I'm so disgusting my wife doesn't want me to use the white towels to dry myself off in case I missed some something so I'm drying myself with shop rags and all those days are over hopefully but things are going really well all is good just want to give you a quick update exciting times take care everybody have a great day PSSS um, you saw us on the greens with those little spinny jobs checking all those greens so we are we're going to sod the greens complexes on hole seven and hole eight next week that's the reason why we're going through the greens and making sure that the amount of sand in the greens and all the con greens contours themselves are just right. I have personally checked seven and eight and they are good to go. They match the gravel drainage blanket underneath. So I have approved those greens for grassing and number nine will be done here shortly. The there's a little bit of too much greens mix, green sand on nine, so they have to pull some of it out. Um, so that will be done either today, or uh, not today, either tomorrow or Monday, they'll finish nine. But we're not gonna have enough sod to sod nine by Monday, so, or Tuesday when we get that truckload of sod in, we're not gonna have enough to do seven, eight, and nine. Just, we'll be lucky to get seven and eight. So, greens complexes are going very well, and we're moving right along. But, just wanted to give you a quick update on the greens too. All's good. See ya!